Have you ever paused to ponder the roots of social media? As a society, we're so engrossed in our screens, scrolling through feeds, liking, commenting, and sharing, that we seldom stop to think about how this all began. Once upon a time, interaction was limited to face-to-face -face conversations, letters, and telephone calls. Fast forward to the present day, and we're living in a digital age where global communication is just a tap away. But how did we get here? Our journey begins in the late 1970s with the advent of the first real form of social media, the BBS, or bulletin board system. These online meeting places were used to download games and software, read news, and exchange messages with others. Then in the late 1980s, we saw the rise of internet relay chats, or IRCs. These allowed real-time communication, paving the way for instant messaging apps that we're all so fond of today. The dawn of the new millennium ushered in a new era of social media. In 2002, the first modern social media platform, Friendster, was launched. It allowed users to create profiles, post photos, and connect with friends. A year later, in 2003, MySpace came onto the scene and quickly became the most visited social media site in the world. In 2004, a little something called Facebook was launched. Initially intended for college students, it quickly expanded to include the general public, and the rest, as they say, is history. Fast forward to 2006 and we saw the birth of Twitter, a platform that allowed users to share their thoughts in 140 characters or less. In the years that followed, we saw the rise of Instagram, Snapchat, and many more platforms, each with its unique features and offerings. So here we are, in the year 2023, with a plethora of social media platforms at our fingertips. They've revolutionized the way we communicate, connect, and share our lives. They've made the world a smaller place, bridging geographical distances and cultural divides. But it's important to remember that, like all things, social media has its pros and cons. It's a powerful tool for connection and communication, but it can also be a breeding ground for misinformation, cyberbullying, and other negative aspects. In conclusion, social media has come a long way since its humble beginnings. From BBS and IRCs to Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, it's been quite a journey. It's transformed our communication, our relationships, and our society as a whole. So next time you pick up your phone to check your social media, take a moment to appreciate the incredible journey it represents. And remember to use social media mindfully and responsibly, for it's a tool that holds great power, both for good and for ill. And while you're at it, do hit the subscribe button for Tailscape Treasury to stay updated on more such enlightening topics. Thank you for tuning in. Until next time, keep pondering, keep learning.